Hello, my name is Leopold Armesto and in this presentation I'm going to introduce you how to use instruction in order to work with the digital humidity temperature sensor DHT11 with Facilino. So this is the outline of the presentation. I'm going to introduce you the material that we use for this presentation, then I will introduce you the instructions that we will work with them and two exercises. In the first exercise I'm going to show you how to plot temperature and humidity using Facilino and in the second uh, exercise I'm going to show you how to generate alarms whenever the temperature or the humidity changes to uncomfortable values. So as usual this is the material that we use for this presentation, it's the Wemos T1R32 together with the Arduino multi-sensor shield. In particular, in this presentation, we are going to work with a temperature sensor connected to pin D4. So, these are the main instructions that we are going to work with. So, the first instruction, for instance, is measuring the temperature, and you can select because there's a family of sensors related with uh, this kind of uh, digital humidity and temperature sensors. So, we, are, uh, we can select the type of sensor and we can select the pin where it's connected to and this will return the temperature in Celsius. There's an equivalent instruction for humidity that will return the relative humidity in a percentage. So also we have an alarm instruction in which we can have uh, a case where or to generate or to in include some instructions whenever the temperature rises when the temperature is ok or when uh, the temperature goes down. We can do that every time, so if the temperature is too hot then we will execute these instructions here or we just can click or check this uh, field here and it will just simply warn once, ok, so we get a warning, just one warning. And this instruction is useful whenever we need to send a uh, messages, let's say, over internet, like sending an email, for instance. In addition to this, uh, in this uh, presentation we are going to work with the, this instruction, the every instruction, it will generate a task on the specified time, but it's not an interrupt, it's on the main, we, we have to put this instruction on the main loop. Also, we are going to use this serial plot multiple data instruction, in which we can plot multiple data together and, and plot it and show it in the Arduino plotter. So let's move to the first example in which we are uh, reading the temperature as I said before and also we have the humidity measurement here and we are just simply saving these uh, values on uh, two uh, variables and in order to work properly between readings we have to wait between one and two seconds, so this is why I have included here the wait instruction after each reading, so this is because of the, the digital readings of, of the sensor, it, it needs that time. So we are doing these instructions every 5,000 uh, milliseconds and after reading we are just simply plotting the data as you can see here. Then in the second instruction what do we have is uh, the temperature alarm, so we are checking every time if the temperature is changing or not. As you can see I have to click and check here the word, word just one, so it's every time the temperature changes from one case to another it will execute the instructions, but only once. So as you can see here if the temperature is too high then we say okay this is too hot, if not temperature is it's perfect and if it's, uh, if it's too cold we print the, the, this message and also we do the same for the humidity, so we say it's too humid, perfect humidity or too dry. Ok, so uh, in this presentation I have shown you how to use instructions for working with the DHT11 sensor with Facilino. Thank you very much and I hope to see you on my next video.